All right, it is time for our Kid Pasta Report, and Kimberly Foster is joining us today. Good morning, how are you? Good morning, Christina. I'm great. How are you? That's great, and we are feeling very festive on set today. Yes, I know you're feeling are. that way as well. Absolutely. I have a list of Christmas events for you guys. All right, let's get started. So kicking off tonight, the El Paso Public Library is featuring um, a series of events, uh, Santa Claus visits to their different branches. Okay. Santa will be there at 5.30 p.m. at the Belvedere uh, branch in West El Paso. This event series continues through the 20th of December, so if you live on the east side, don't worry about it. You can still catch Santa. Um, they'll be, he'll be there reading stories. You can take your picture with Santa. They'll have refreshments, live music as well, and you can actually find the full schedule online on their website. Very nice, and you don't have to be quiet while you're at the library for this event because Santa's there, so it's going to be pretty crowded and lots of fun, so bring your kids out to that. Definitely. Okay, what else do you have for and us? And then um, I mentioned last week the 50th anniversary of the Living Christmas Tree is taking okay. place at First Baptist Church. Very nice. This is such a cool event. I don't know if you've been, no. but they pretty much station the choir in this really amazing structure that looks like a Christmas tree. So that's why they call it the Living Christmas Tree. And nothing like listening to a choir. I mean, it's, there's just something about it that's so sort of magical. It really is. It just really touches your heart. So they're performing Friday through Sunday at First Baptist Church, okay. Friday, 7.30 p.m., Sunday, or Saturday, excuse me, 4.30 and 7.30, and then Sunday again at 4.30 and 7.30 p.m. Okay, something tells me you have more Christmas I stuff? I do. Yeah. More uh, live entertainment. This is at Sierra Vista Church, the Spirit of Christmas. They actually have added some new and extended scenes to this uh, really nice Christmas pageant. This takes place at Sierra Vista Church. Um, on Friday, excuse me, 7.30 p.m., Saturday at 4 and 7.30 p.m., and then Sunday at 5 p.m. Uh, tickets can be purchased at the door or online for both events, for the Sale of Vista one and then also for the Living Christmas Tree. I forgot to mention that. <laughs> um, and, right. and then next week, I'm going to head into next week, next Thursday, the El Paso Museum of History is hosting a traditional uh, Mexican posada. Now, that's a very, very special, and, and I wonder why they're having it there in particular. Do you know? Just celebrating the history of El Paso and just kind of traditions that we observe as El Pasoans. So if you haven't been to a traditional posada, this is going to be like a nice little sneak peek in case you don't have family or friends that celebrate this over the nine days. Um, they're going to have a piñata breaking. Oh, piñatas. Holiday. It's all very, very festive. It is super very, very festive. Very, Mexicano. It is. It's wonderful. Holiday songs, candy, tamales, hot chocolate, and then um, live music and a theatrical performance as well. I am so there. Awesome. You said hot chocolate. That I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, there's more events also happening as well in the city. So you can go to our website, visitelpaso.com or elpasolive.com and find out more information. Kimberly, thank you so much for joining us. You have a wonderful list for us today. So, awesome. Thank you so much. Happy holidays. Happy holidays.